Hundreds gathered this past weekend for the 13th annual Walk-A-Mile, hosted by the Grant County Rescue Mission. Every year, rain or shine, the event draws a crowd to raise funds for the mission and let people walk a mile out in the cold and in the shoes of Grant County's homeless. And this year, thanks to some changes at the rescue mission, a new group of participants is leading the pack out of the YMCA and into the frigid cold. Mission Program Director Neil Kirby has been overseeing the development of a new life change program, a program for men who need help and have nowhere else to turn. The program, uh, the life change program here at the Grant County Rescue Mission is designed to help men find freedom from all of those hurts, habits, and hang-ups that we, as we refer to them, from their past. But all in all, it's designed to help bring them freedom from those things that have, have held them back. For program newcomer Frank Reed, those things that held him back took hold at a very early age. I started drinking when I was like 13, and I, I liked it at first, I had a blast, and then it started getting worse and worse and worse to where I wanted to drink more and more and more. That's where the trouble started. After a night of heavy drinking and waking up behind the wheel, Frank knew that enough was enough, and he found himself at the doorstep of the Grant County Rescue Mission. And then uh, something told me, well, you need to get help, get help, get help. Because this was the first mission I ever stayed at. And I thought, well, you know, that might work. I've never stayed at a mission. I didn't know what to expect. But the first night I was here, I was happy. I was, what? Because before, I was miserable. This place was like home, and it still is. With courses on the Bible, financial, and even emotional management, the program has been a huge success for Frank and others who found themselves in need of a helping hand. And now, Frank and the other members of the Life Change program are helping lead the way, raising awareness for those less fortunate, and appreciating having somewhere to land when things are spiraling out of control. I would have been on the street because my brother and sister, if I kept drinking, they wouldn't let me stay there. That's why I'm glad I found this place. I'm glad I, glad I went to Cornerstone and then I found this place. I don't hate myself anymore and I'm happy. I, what, I don't remember the last time I was happy before I came here and that's the honest truth. It's a life change program and that, that's exactly what it does. I love it. For Crossroads, I'm Russ Clark.